what's up y'all welcome back to another video if you guys are new here my name is jaji and today we are going to be doing a long awaited clothing haul the last time i did a haul on my channel was summer of 2022 and we're about to get into spring of 2023 summer's literally right around the corner y'all have definitely gotten on me about forgetting about the hauls on my channel so we're bringing it back for the one time today i'm going to be working with a brand that you may or may not have heard before if you're anything like me i see their ads all over everywhere all over instagram all over tiktok if you haven't heard about them you're hearing about them today we are working with cider Let's just take a second to thank Cider for partnering with me on today's video and allowing me to bring back a good old try on haul. Just want to give you guys a little rundown on Cider if you do not know anything about them. One thing and probably the biggest thing I love about Cider is the fact that they have an aesthetic to fit literally everyone on their website. So if you do have a specific style niche, whether that's dressing Y2K, preppy, streetwear, Cider has something for literally everyone on their website, no matter what mood, aesthetic, vibe you're going for for the day, Cider's got you covered. So another thing I love about Cider is the fact that they have some really good quality quality pieces and all their pieces only range from 20 to 30 dollars and that's pretty good considering the fact that i've got tops to bottoms to whole coats to show you guys in this haul i'm talking about like full-on fur lined coats for 20 to 30 dollars cider does also ship to over 130 countries which usually takes around five to ten days but you also get free shipping on orders that are 39 dollars or more last but not least if your outfits do not turn out as planned we all know how that goes or if you're like me and you don't like checking the sizing charts before you buy things cider also does offer free returns with every single order so we're gonna get straight into the haul because i have a couple of pieces that i want to show you guys i told myself that i was going to shop in outfits because i'm very guilty of buying a whole bunch of like stray pieces and somehow with all the hauls that i've done on this channel i still can somehow never find anything to wear i have a couple of pieces that go together some things worked out some things didn't because i did not check the sizing chart like i said don't be like me check the sizing charts we are going to start off with outfit number one which definitely might be one of my favorites we're gonna start with the base of the outfit everything will be linked in the description of course the first thing we have is just a plain black crop top i always love to get basics in every single haul every time i go shopping i have to grab at least one basic because you can never have too much there's not too too much to say about this but we're building on the outfit for the pants that i pair with this outfit we have a pair of faux leather pants and these are such good quality they also do have these cute little apple tags which i just think is like the cutest thing ever everybody needs a good pair of leather pants in their wardrobe and i've been looking for a pair of leather pants but for some reason i can never find any to fit me they either fit my waist or they're too big on my legs or they're too long and they don't fit my waist they're too tight on the waist another thing about leather pants they're usually the most uncomfortable things in the world these are super comfortable so you can do a lot of things with a nice pair of leather pants to put this outfit together i added on this faux leather jacket with like these white stripes down the arm if you know me you know i live for these like biker motorsport kind of looking jackets this little button on the neck just gets me every time i'm a sucker for these type of jackets it does have like a cutout in the front it's also a little bit cropped which it's not a big problem when it's on it actually looks really nice and i will probably wear like silver accessories just giving a very much like a little men in black moment so next up we have this outfit which i actually underestimated i didn't think i'd like it as much as i do you're definitely gonna see me wearing this on my instagram so to start off the outfit we have this guy or this girl this top is really cute it's also kind of like a knitted ribbed material which i also really like because it is really good quality of course obviously the top is sleeveless but it does have like this little mock neck and i feel like it dresses it up like the slightest bit but it still gives like casual chill vibes you compare this with a skirt you compare it with pants you compare it with cargos i actually did cargos i feel like you can do a lot of different things with the shirt like i said i did choose to pair my top with cargos and these are them just a normal black pair of cargos that they're kind of like a wide leg rather than a straight leg sure if i would have searched on the website a little bit better i probably could have found something that was a little more straight rather than like flaring out they also were a little more snug than i would have liked so i probably size up but they also do have this stretchy waistband with the drawstring which is always nice to fit to your waist last piece of this outfit similar to the last one we are saved by the jacket and this is another faux leather jacket i don't have a lot of jackets in this color so i decided to go for like an army green rather than a black this one is also obviously a different style than the first one very versatile jacket i feel like i say that for a lot of these pieces but it's the truth like you can do a whole lot of stuff with a whole lot of these pieces this next outfit i actually did decide to get another pair of those leather pants but i got them in burgundy they do fit exactly the same as the black ones they're good quality everything is the same literally just a different color for this outfit i feel like i tried to go a little more on like the bohemian boho coachella kind of vibe if i'm being completely honest this did not go 100% how I had it planned out in my head for two reasons one I didn't have the proper undergarments to be trying this on and two I don't want to get demonetized so the idea was definitely there we're gonna have to try this one again and then like I said I don't know we were going for like a Coachella vibe I don't know what I was thinking when I ordered this because I definitely do not dress like I'm going to Coachella but you know I just thought we'd test cider and like what they're really about like can you really fit every vibe I ended up getting this like weaved bucket hat I actually think this is really cute to like go on the beach I don't want to mess up my hair but like 
a cute little you know so this next outfit that i have is actually only two pieces so it's not like a full ensemble but i think they're pretty cool pieces one of them actually fits me a little tight but again cider offers free returns on every order so i will be getting my size in these pants we do have another pair of cargos because i am most definitely a cargo girly i'm really sad that these didn't fit i got them on for the trial haul but they're definitely a little tight they're definitely a little snug on me but i actually love the colors on these cargos they kind of give me like camo but not camo if that makes sense they have like the same neutral colors like you compare this with a whole bunch of things i need to get these pants in my size because these would go to good use messing with me the top that i paired with the cargos is something very different and definitely out of my comfort zone but i love this top for starters it is so freaking soft it does have a hoodie it is also cropped it has these little bits of distressing which again i feel like it just adds to whatever this vibe is called it just adds to it i do think this top is really different and i'm excited to see what i can do with this in the meantime while i fix those pants um so for the next outfit i actually did go ahead and get a pair of denims again this is too small on me do not be like me check the sizing charts because it's like the most disappointing thing ever 100 my fault cider gives me the measurements i just don't check them and i just think oh okay i'm just gonna get it in my size i did manage to get into them but just barely so their jeans really good quality it's actual denim not the fake denim that a lot of these other companies try to sell you it's it's real real tough denim this is my favorite wash of jeans I don't like too light I don't like too dark this is the perfect denim wash for me in the trial part you guys are probably gonna notice that I had those pair of jeans on with like a couple different outfits because there was another pair of denims that didn't fit me so I had to kind of substitute that in just so you guys can still get the vibe of the outfit first thing I planned on pairing those pants with was actually this top and I love the colors on this top that's why I wore it in this video and you guys are probably like oh my god where's she get her top from cider sis tops from cider it's just like your average spring summer crop top two shades of blue cute salmon pink I love this color combination you guys are definitely gonna see me wearing this like in my vlog this crop top and then you know your little blue denims a little fun fresh cute spring little outfit another thing i paired the blue jeans with is this like hot pink fuchsia kind of top and it's extremely stretchy and i don't know if you guys can see this but it's like a furry material it really does play into like that mohair trend that we've been seeing everywhere everybody's wearing mohair wearing this top made me feel like a teacher i don't know why this just gives me like the fun art teacher but it is also really comfortable now on top of that i paired this jacket that i showed you guys in the beginning i know it's like a fur on fur moment but i think it was cute this was definitely one of the pieces that when i got it i was extremely surprised surprised with the quality like this entire thing is lined everywhere inside the sleeves they did not skimp out on the fur like everything is lined for this last outfit i'm not gonna lie i was a little disappointed and i ended up getting these jeans but they do not fit me i'm pretty sure you guys can tell on camera that this denim is obviously a very different wash i was so freaking mad when i found out that these didn't fit because if it was anything in this haul that i wanted to fit it was these jeans this jacket was actually another piece that caught me by surprise both in the way that it fit and then also the quality crazy enough i actually bought this jacket in a plus size I got it in a 0XL and I love the way it fits. Now do you see why I said those jeans would have probably went really nice with this? Because it would have brought out the brown and the, the old timey vibe. The regular denims just don't do that for this jacket. Y'all, I done got so excited with that jacket. I forgot to show you guys the shirt that I had on underneath, which is this white top. We're ending it off really calm classy you can definitely dress this up wear this like a pencil skirt or just any other type of skirt all right so we're finally at the end of the haul i know so sad it had to be over so those are all the outfits and pieces that i had to show you guys from cider i try to keep it really short straight to the point just give you guys your pieces let you guys go again just another thank you to cider for partnering with me on today's video allowing me to bring the hauls back if you guys saw anything you liked in this haul of course you can find it on the cider website which you can shop with my link in the description and while you're at it you can use my code Josh Dior for 15 percent off and i don't want to keep you guys here too long but if you did enjoy the video make sure to like comment and subscribe to see more of moi and that's about it for me so do yours you are out of here